Hello, Eisenhower. Students have been using the app called EdSight. EdSight allows teachers to create interactive and high-quality assignments to fit their classroom needs. Let's go see what teachers and students think about EdSight. So, um, Will, what class do you use EdSight in? Ms. Tyrone's math class. Uh, do you like EdSight? I do. It's a very good way to, uh, you know, give quizzes at home on the online because a lot of kids like to use the online. That's good. So I'm here with Timmy. So Timmy, what do you think with about EdSight? Uh, it's pretty good, I guess. I mean, t it's good for teachers because they can sign assignments like on Google Classroom or something like that when students are at home. So it's pretty good. What teacher do you have EdSight with? Uh, Miss Tyrone. Thank you. Uh, what do you think about EdSight? I think it's very similar to Google Classroom, and it's very efficient and effective. Nice. Uh, so, Jack, what class do you use EdSight in? I use EdSight in math. Um, do you like EdSight? Uh, yeah, I think EdSight's a pretty good source because I can use it in math, and um, I can take quizzes that she assigns, and then she can grade them, or it could be auto-graded. So I think it's a great source, great source. Thanks. Yeah, no problem. So, Mr. Ron, why do you, why do you use EdSight instead of Google Forms? Um, I like EdSight better, uh, the Google Forms. Google Forms does great for you, just like EdSight does, but um, EdSight has the possibility to create questions that look like the park test. Um, you can click and drag things in order. You can have students type in math equations and use um, all the different special characters that math has and fractions and exponents and things like that. Um, and I think that it's a real good test for um, students to get used to what they're going to see on the park test in the spring. Thank you. You're welcome. As you can see, Eisenhower really loves EdSight. Keep on learning, Eisenhower.